HUD activated. Commence briefing. Approaching Iran. Data on the subject. Kadir Suleiman. A local political figure hired to maintain order after the outbreak. His brother Hassan died in a disease-related incident before we were able to evacuate him. Suleiman blamed the GRE for Hassan's death. He stole a highly sensitive file which became his bargaining chip against the GRE, with instructions to publicize it if anything happened to him. Data on the subject. The stolen file. Jump in 10 seconds. It details the incomplete process of synthesizing a cure for the virus. If implemented in its current state, the produced substance may be extremely toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description of the virion structure. Any attempt to use it would result in countless lives lost. It must be recovered. Further information, current status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. To counter that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Your GRE issued radio can overcome that jamming. It is your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file in order to save mankind from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. I told you that wasn't a normal drop shoot. Break his legs, then take him to rides. Back up! All of you! Stop! Loud noises draw them! Fall back! Fall back! Sensitivity is way too high. Let me, let me change that down real quick. Whatever. You sleep for three days like a dead man, then scare children. Off to a great start, 31. Where am I? In paradise, can't you see? Okay, enough joking around. Head to room 190. The boss will brief you. What do you mean, 31? Ask the boss. Thirty-one. That's your number. I'm gonna go through room one night. See the boss. 
Amir died because of this guy? Quiet. Now he's gonna get him. This is dying late. Right? It's very old now, and dying light is soon to come out. So I was thinking, you know, why not do uh, let's play on the first game before the second game comes out. I've been wanting to do a series on dying light for a while. Hey, I'm looking for the. Are you the boss? What, am I too young? You got the problem with my age? No, I... You wanted to talk to me? That's better. Do you remember anything? Know what you are? Yeah, I can, I can see this is some kind of shelter. We call it the Tower. Brecken and his runners put it all together a couple of months ago, and we've been here ever since. Hunting airdrops, scavenging, and rescuing people. Yeah, I, I wanted to thank that girl. Good, because if not for her, you'd already be chewing somebody's knee bone. Your Anderson was totally crushed, by the way. Only thing Jade could salvage was your radio. Oh, great. So can I get that back, please? Actually, I think I need it more than you do. Believe me, pal, that's not the case. Fine. Take it. You know why runners put their lives in danger? For guys like you. So now you take the antisen meant for someone else, and you won't even share your gear with us? I don't have time to deal with your bullshit. I've lost contact with one of our guys, thanks to the fucked up radios we're stuck with. Do something for me, would you? I don't want to see you or your precious radio anymore, so go be useful somewhere else. We don't tolerate lazy assholes here in the tower. Hey, be fair. I'm not, I'm not lazy. I'm just, hey, boss. Save it. That lost guy I mentioned, he's only on the 13th floor, but he might as well be trapped in a mine cave -in. Come back later. And I'm not the boss. Too young, remember? I'm Rahim. Brecken's in charge here. Okay. I would kill for I'm not lazy, you little shit. I'll close the door behind us. Check for the lost survivor on the 13th floor. Yeah, we gotta get in the elevator. Where do you think you're going? The thirteenth floor. I'm getting some stuff for Raheem. Thirteen? Shit. That's gonna be some dirty work. But we all got to pull our weight around here, huh? Jesus. How many people died here? Here. Where were you? We've been waiting for your report. It's been over 70 hours. I lost my radio for a while. Don't worry, my cover's intact. No contact with the tower's leader yet. Unable to confirm identity. I'm taking steps to blend in. Acknowledged. Time is of the essence, Crane. Remember that. There's, there's one more thing. I, I got bitten. I've shown no symptoms, but the people here say I'm infected. Then you'd better get your hands on some antisent ASAP. Help! Hadn't you? Help! Somebody! What the hell? We got a weapon now. <laughs> we got a pipe. <laughs> yeah. I cut my arm getting away from him. Oh, God. You had to kill him, didn't you? God! That was... That was my brother. I came down to see him and... Easy, easy. It's all right now. I'll, I'll get help. Hey, Raheem, this is Crane. I'm down here on 13. Listen, this guy of yours got fucked up pretty bad getting away from a zombie. Oh, shit. 31? You went after Mark? Is it... Is it safe down there? Yeah, well, it's safe enough now. Okay, don't move. I'm sending Lena downstairs. Take 
care of Mark. Hey, hold still. Lena will be here any minute. Gauze! You've got to find some gauze! Oh, and alcohol! Combine them. That will stop the bleeding. Please hurry! I try to stay calm. Okay. We gotta find alcohol and gauze. I found some gauze. Okay, okay I think that's everything I'm gonna find. Let's give this a shot. I to enter Alcohol. Blueprints. Uh, medkit. Create. Okay, who's hurt? He's bleeding pretty bad. Let me see him. Goes in alcohol, huh? Pretty primitive, but it'll work. Thanks for the help. I'll take care of him from here. Okay. Well done, 31. Hey, 31. Not bad for a new guy. Perhaps I misjudged you. Yeah, I just want to help out and repay you guys for what you did for me. Well, good. Come find me, and we'll talk about how you can do that. All right, taken care of. Piece of cake. What else you got for me? Well, let me think. Rahim? You are just smart enough to be dangerous, you know that? Omar told me about your plans for the nest. Explosive charges? Really? What? Explosives? Oh, I never please. said that. You can't tell a convincing lie to save your life. I know what I'm doing. Yeah? You think you can't die? You're not my mom. No, I'm not. Our mom's dead. So you might want to be a little nicer to me since I'm the only family you have left. Especially now that Amir is gone. You're Jade, right? Right. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for me and, and tell you how sorry I am for your loss. I owe you and Amir my life. Yeah, you do. You want to return the favor? Keep my dipshit brother from killing himself. No explosives, Rahim. Mm -hmm. So... So, is that enough? Do I get to talk to Brecken now? He looks for your life, First, Marie. go change your clothes. I left some new ones for you in your room. You're in 194. Something okay, wrong with what I'm wearing? You need something that fits the job Brecken wants you to do. Call me when you've changed. How do I change clothes? Change your fit. Okay. Okay, Rahim, I'm ready. Where do I find Brecken? Not so fast, 31. If you're going to earn your keep, we have to find out if you've got the skills. So get your ass up to the gym. To the gym. It's on the top floor. Just a couple flights up. I don't get the elevator. Okay. Don't be a wimp. Come on, you can't be serious. Watch this. Rahim! My leg! Jesus, don't move! I'll get help! Ha! I was just fucking with you! <laughs> Son of a bitch! What? You can't take a joke? Come on! Get your ass down here! Christ on a crutch. I'm gonna do a sick jump. Watch this. Oh shit, I missed. Bro! Oh. Okay. We just gotta do a crappy board. Holy right? shit! Holy shit! <laughs> it's a rush, isn't it? But don't blow your load just yet. There's more. To survive outside, I've got some typical situations set up for you. Let's see how you handle them. Sometimes it's 
better to crawl through the low, narrow passages. Ethers will have a tough time following you. <clears throat> Try not to slow down once you start running. Outside, if you stop, you're probably dead. Not bad. For a noob. Hey, I'm not a noob. Alright, get up on that scaffold. And don't fall, because there sure as hell ain't no net. Ooh. Did I just... I'll run all the way back around now, because I fell. <coughs> okay. I'm not gonna fall this time. I'm a pro, remember? That's my favorite. Cat grab and muscle up. You won't survive outside for 10 minutes if you can't do that. I've got another ledge with OW. <laughs> oh god, okay. <coughs> oh, okay. Good job. Okay, time for the real test. Get back to the crane. Make use of anything and everything while you run. Oh, crap. Okay. Ooh, that's a big drop. Natural talent, man. Either that, or you've done this before. You've done this before? I go back. Yeah, I think you go back here. What? What is happening to me? Crane? Shit. Shit. Oh, oh shit. Crane, talk to me. What's going on? Something went wrong. Rahim, what just happened to me? Oh, shit. I bet you're having your first seizure. Back over here. Okay. I had a seizure on top of a crane. God. Raheem, what the fuck was that? Does this mean I'm I'm turning? Most likely no. At least not yet. Caesars reminds you that you're infected. You better go see Dr. Zera, though. He'll check you out, probably give you a shot of antizen. Before you head out to see Zera, talk to the quartermaster. He'll uh, gear you up so you can go outside without getting your head bitten off. All right, boys. I'm gonna end this here. I don't know if I'll make this a full series or not. Uh, tell me in like the comments or some shit if you want me to make it full series because I don't know this is okay so far and uh it tell me if I should make longer episodes or not because it's been like well I've been recording for 30 minutes only uh drop a like subscribe all that shit okay bye